All right, welcome to this edition of my Tesla Timeout series on my YouTube channel. I'm here getting some stuff done to my Model 3, something I've wanted to do for quite some time, an ambient lighting kit. I've looked at all kinds of different things on YouTube and on you know, different uh, Tesla product sites, Amazon, all this kind of stuff. But you know, the ones that plug into 12 volt and all this kind of stuff, they're just, they're not as good as what you can get done by a professional. So I'm here with Johnny of Wild Rise. How are you, Johnny? It's Wired Rides. Wired, I said wild. <laughs> wired Rides, yeah, that's wired a rides. tongue twister. I gotta <laughs> practice that. Yeah. Um, and he's just finished doing my car, putting in a, a brand new, um, kind of state-of-the-art ambient lighting kit. So, you know, I'll show you a little bit about that, but uh, thanks for doing that. No uh, maybe you could tell my, my viewers and listeners a little bit about the business and what you what you guys specialize in. Yeah, so, I mean, we've been doing this for many, many years, yeah. but we basically specialize in like automotive lighting. Mm -hmm. So ambient lighting, even starlight headliners we do, we've got a project on the go right now. Mm -hmm. um, and then what one of my like daily kind of things that I do is custom headlights. Okay. So we can take headlights, open them up, Yep. Uh, modify them on the inside. We got a lot of different wow. different products that we can do. And yeah. so yeah, I mean, yep. then we got people that come in to do all the fancy stuff, yeah. Yeah. show cars. They want to you know really stand out at night when they're in a you know car meet and things like that. So we would do like yeah. multicolor stuff or even like you know it, it just depends. You Everybody's under, got their own stuff. Underglow stuff. stuff you yeah, were we do, as and well. we actually make yeah. our own kits like in house. Oh, okay. So it's all made to the car. So it's wow. not like an off the shelf kit that we just kind of stick on. Okay. We'll actually measure the bottom of the car. We yeah. make the pieces to the car. Yeah. <laughs> um, so for this particular application, Johnny, yeah. we talked. And, and I knew that you, you, you told me a few months ago that you were getting a new kit, a new type of kit. Correct. You know, it's kind of different to the market than what we've seen. So if you've looked at some of the ambient lighting, and again, um, again, you do these kits for any cars. It's not just Tesla. Like right. some shops are more specialized. You're, you're doing all kinds Everything, of different yeah. cars. And this particular kit, uh, according to what you told me, is, is has a different type of LED mecha a stream lighting mechanism where it's not just a couple of lights coming from the ends shooting into a tube. This is more advanced. Can you explain that a little yeah, bit? Yeah, so the, the ambient lights that you see more like, you know, you can just kind of buy readily online yeah. is like, it's like a plastic tube uh -huh. that you kind of like wedge in yeah. and then it's an LED on each side. Right. Um, and then the LED kind of passes through this fiber optic thing. Mm -hmm. The thing with that is that you ten, the light and tends to be brighter near the ends because that's what the LED is yeah. and it can't travel nice and even all the way across. Mm -hmm. um, and then uh, the other problem is that especially when it's sunny out, the sun's brighter than these LEDs. Right. So you end up not seeing any color at all during the day. Right. And you've got this ugly like like rope thing going across your dash. Right. So right. this is like a little tiny blade. It's almost a, like, like, like not even a millimeter, mm -hmm. like thick, like really, really mm -hmm. thin little blade. And it's lined with LEDs, like hundreds mm -hmm. and hundreds of tiny, tiny little LEDs, full color changing. So mm -hmm. you'll, you'll see in the video, basically like, you'll get even light all the way across. There's yeah. no dead spots. It's not brighter in some areas, nice and clean all the way across. Yeah. Um, and then, yeah, and then, and because they're so tiny and so versatile, like we can put them in like small little crevices. Mm -hmm. It looks factory. Like when the lights are off, you That's don't even know thinking. they're there. Yeah. As soon it's, as I saw it, I'm going, this is like a, an OEM, yeah. right? Yeah. Uh, You're yeah. picking up a, an Audi or a BMW product with, with built in ambient lighting. And this is what it looks yeah, like. Exactly. You know, and really, usually really nice. our kits also have like a yeah. pod that goes in the door pocket. So mm -hmm. you'll see that as well. We did. Yeah. And then on some cars that have like an actual physical door handle, on a Tesla, it's a button, yeah. so we don't have it, but on yeah. we would even put a little light in the door handle, oh, cool. so it lights up the little door handle. Yeah, yeah. Um, and then, yeah, and then our kits always come with the floors lighting up as well, which you'll see mm -hmm. in this vehicle. Yep. Um, and then it's all Bluetooth controlled. You'll be able to yep. change the different colors. You can have the doors one color, mm -hmm. the floor a different color. It's all you know, set up on the phone, yeah. um, you know, activated by music and things yeah. like that. So, yeah, we were so, yeah. playing around with it. I've got to spend some time with the app, but <laughs> I'm more of just give me a single color and I'm happy and then I could change <laughs> right. it once in a while, but right. it's pretty cool. I'll probably end up using that because I do a lot of public outreach and uh, this car gets a lot of looks, so it's nice to fancy it up and put some music with some lights going just yeah. as it draws. So, and so these are newer kits, as you said, very high quality and yep. uh, the controllers, everything is wired properly. Yep. Um, and it's a pretty, again, you know, folks, you'll, you're seeing by the videos, this is, really is an OEM finish. So if, you know, anybody's living in the Southern Ontario realm, you know, first of all, um, you know, I'll have the link to Johnny's website um, in the show notes as well, and I'll, I'll put it on the screen. Again, any last thoughts about about this particular kit that you want uh, viewers to know uh, and, and your services as well? Yeah, well, I mean, like, what's nice about this kit is that they are kind of like Bluetooth controlled mm -hmm. in terms of like uh, like each door transmits to a brain. Yeah. So basically, that way we're not running like lots of wires like through the door looms right. and things like that. Yeah. It's a lot cleaner. Yeah. In that in that respect, but then. 
that we do run into issues or not issues, but like sometimes with like particular cars, like this Tesla doesn't actually have a solid power in each door. Yeah. <laughs> so then we yeah. actually did have to run our yes. own wires through and everything. Yeah. But again, when you open the doors, you'll see it all goes through the factory loom. We put it all back like factory. Nice. Nice. You won't even know we were there. And yeah. even when we grab the power and all that, it's yeah. not like we're plugging into a 12 volt, you right. know, volt socket right. or anything. Right. It's straight to the fuse box. It's nice and clean. It's got nice. its own fuse and everything. That's true. Uh, and the, the system's also got to have a fuse and things like that to mm -hmm. keep it safe as well. Yeah. And yeah, everything is there. Everything is in there. If Tesla was to do it, this is how they would do it. Yeah. So. And they won't yeah. do it because they're too busy <laughs> trying to build cars fast <laughs> enough. So. Exactly. Yeah. Well, again, all the information will be in the show notes. So definitely check out Johnny in Wired rides i'm going to say it correctly <laughs> now uh again ultimate professional but doing it a long time and if you're going to get work done folks my opinion especially if you know I, i'm keeping my car for another 10 years at least if not more and i want a job that's done right and you know somebody i can reach out to if there's an issue but um th this looks really good and i know you've, you've been doing it for a long time so again thank you very much yeah, no i'm problem. really like, super excited about <laughs> this right. and no uh, looking forward to it all right all right thanks Soaring through New York City Like in my dreams with New York pretty I wanna fly down in New York City When scheming light in New York's pretty Awakening is falling, dreaded hot Be sure to stay and stay at high Bright stone down that hard and night fly Central hero shining silver beach lullaby And I'd rather be there in New York Up down from New York City.